You made my decision. Well, Luke has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of this. Sarah, Sarah was a young girl, I think. Maybe a girl's daughter. Aren't, aren't they wasting these candles a bit, letting them be lit when there's no one in the room? Let's listen. Somebody. There's no way she's out here by herself. She said she was with a friend. They got attacked. Yeah, right. Whoever she's with, they'll probably come looking for her. Great. The screen started turning red. I assumed that meant that they were about to detect me, so I backed away. I want to get upstairs, but oh, there we go. It's very hard to move quietly in a house like this. I wonder how she knows that that's the bathroom door, but uh, I'm going to assume that's where the medical supplies are. Any more when you put it in your pockets? So some bandages and something to keep it from getting infected. Uh. Oh no, shower, shower. Running water? Let it be okay. Let it be his. <laughs> Let it be his. That reminds me, uh, I did briefly mention that I, I called it when Krista was pregnant at the beginning. I really liked how they didn't make that obvious, totally obvious in the, in the season 1, but they very, very much hinted to it. So it wasn't kind of very hard to pick up, but i still very happy that I uh, was able to pick that, pick those little hints up and uh, figure that she was pregnant. <laughs> You're not supposed to be in here. No. Hi. Can you please help me? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. I know. What are you reading? A book? What book? I like books. Called the Gurgles. It's about transdimensional body snatchers. Cool. What happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. You 
You want to see it? Um, it really wasn't one of them. It really wasn't. Okay. Ew, gross. I know, right? You have to bandage it like my dad does. Yeah, I know. Help me. I need something to clean it up and something to wrap it with. A clean bandage. My dad says we're out of real bandages, but I know where to get something to clean it. That's what this supplies. I'll help you. Good. Thank you. I'm Sarah. I'm Clementine. We're friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. And if her baby is a girl, it'll be forever before she's old enough to, like, be my friend. And then I'll be super old. We just met. We're not friends. But we could be. It's hard to have friends you can trust. Which is why we should be. Come on. Please. I'm worried about saying I'll be your friend and then having to do something not friendly. Come on. Please. <laughs> Fine, but I warned you. Friend. <laughs> Pinky swear. A pinky swears forever. I'll see if I can find the stuff my dad uses when I get a cut. Let me look around. I think this is it. That'll work. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry. I won't. So need some bandages. Maybe some clothes or... Clothes or something. Sock would do not very well. Mm. Hmm? Oh, not exactly bandages, but they should help stop the bleeding. Global menace, like risk. Did I hear someone moving or was it me? Ah, can I make it without them seeing me? Things won't be easy. here and now I need to stitch my arm but it's better than cutting it off that's for sure
Right, let's clean it first. This is gonna suck. <laughs> yes, yes, it's real, Clem. Let's go through it together. if I should put my hand in the... Lock it up. No. Just like last time. Just how Krista showed me. Oh, man. It. <sighs> oh, man. One more, one more. <laughs> oh, this is not fun. This is not fun at all. <laughs> Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. No, 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 not like this, not like this. Get the anchor somehow. Something. Please be strong enough. Hammer. Head. I'm not going to enjoy my time this time. I'm not going to enjoy the moment. Get in here. Little girl's tough as nails. Are you all right? 
The shed should have been safe. I, I didn't see my mouse cursor. You patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a baby. Enough already. Guys, please. What the hell happened? She must have stolen it. It didn't just magically appear. Unless she had some help. I couldn't choose any option. Come on, game. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Damn lurker sneaking around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? And I couldn't choose with the number keys either, like I did in the first game. This might hurt a little. Ow. How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in and her temperature would be through the roof. What's wrong with that guy? Maybe he lost someone? I wish you wouldn't have done what you did. I was hurt, and you weren't helping. Because we considered you a threat. Which you were. Maybe you still are. No, I'm not. We put you in that shed out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. And then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially. But once you're around her for a while... You'll understand. If she knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there, she would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left. And I would ask that you stay away from her. She doesn't know about zombies or anything? She needs to grow up sometime. You do not know what she needs. Rebecca was worried you might be working with someone else. That your being here was no accident. I guess we'll find out. But one thing I know for sure. You are not to be trusted. Stay away from my daughter. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. Oh, I totally forgot this guy's name already. That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. <laughs> Better than losing it. Now you can say that again. Scars? They're way cooler than stumps. <laughs> what? Nothing. I just had a friend who lost his arm once. That's all. Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for well, for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. You were just protecting your friends. I get it. Well, I didn't mean to be so harsh. I just... Uh, we had a bad experience once. What happened? Nick lost his mom. We took care of someone who got bit. It was my fault. I... It was no one's fault. We thought we could control it, but we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. And there was nothing we could do about it. Anyway, hopefully you understand.
I do. Yeah. 